Well, I'm not surprised at the response I got from my video. Um, I guess I'm also not surprised at the response time to my video. Uh, when you're living that nomadic life, driving an RV around the desert, towing your test equipment behind you in a trailer, I mean Faraday cage, um, it's probably tough sometimes to find free Wi-Fi in order to upload content for your channel. So I guess I can't fault him for that. Um, but I digress. But you know what? While we're throwing out terms like Faraday cage, um, <laughs> that's one of the things that my coworkers and I get the biggest kick out of when Fine Tune brags about uh, using a Faraday cage to repair and align comm radios in. And again, it just shows that Fine Tune has never in his life worked in a real facility, a real repair facility, um, or for that matter, never been in a real repair facility, you know, one with a federally licensed repair facility uh, with federal oversight. Uh, that is for sure 100% a fact. Um, otherwise, he would know that um, that is the biggest bunch of hogwash on the planet. <laughs> and yeah, we, we get a kick out of those. So, yay, fine tune, please. Keep posting videos bragging about that because we love watching them. It's comedic gold to us. And I'm sure a lot of others uh, across the country that are actually in the industry. Um, please, by, by all means, don't stop bragging about that. We, we love it. Please keep doing it. Um, but you know what? Honestly, um, back to the subject at hand, I think I would rather continue to rely on the manufacturer's data on how to properly use my test equipment than to listen to some self-proclaimed guru in the desert. Uh, I, I think I'll be all right if I just stick with the manufacturer's data. And um, I will continue to repair radios and align radios, my radios. Um, I'm not exactly sure who he, he feels that I'm scamming or defrauding. Uh, I guess that's the the knee-jerk response when somebody calls you out on your horse shit. So if I'm now labeled a scammer um, for working on my own radios and nobody else's, uh, sure, I'll wear it with a badge of honor and uh, my coworkers and I will, will laugh about it and uh, I'll join the ranks of all those others that have called out fine-tune on all of his absolute nonsense and... Uh, I'll continue to do what I do and align and repair my radios, and I will stay away from individuals who are taking pixie dust and spreading it over a software-defined radio that has virtually no internal alignments or adjustments and then selling it at twice the price. Yeah, I think I'll stick to what I do. So uh, 73s, everybody. Uh, this will be my <laughs> last response to this uh, clown in the desert. So take care.